It's super excited, right? Yeah, it's I am. To be, right? It's gonna be fun. It is. Man, you see how big. Hello, my name is Airstar. Please touch my screen or say my name if you need assistance. This is Airstar, the first robot of its kind in the world to work at an airport. Airstar's main job is to escort passengers to their check-in counters or departure gate. Man, you see how big the airport is? It is. All of us. Yes. I think it's about 15. Oh, he is. Yes, yes. Look at this, man. At least I ain't got your port, so I see your port. South Korea, back in the day. You know, we're all the same basket cases and stuff, but look at look at them today, you know? It can speak and understand four languages, Korean, Chinese, English, and Japanese. Let's give it a try. Take me to gate 14. Yes, I'll start the guidance now. You can follow me. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Can you sit next? All right, here comes my other bag. I got you, boy. Yeah. Nice. All right, I'm all set. Looking good. Everybody get their bags. You know, man, it's uh, it's been a. I want to thank God for traveling mercies. It's beautiful. You know, I'm back here safe. Everybody's coming. Got my bag, and um, we'll be all right. We'll be all right. Yeah. This is nice. I like it. <laughs> you know, guys, I'm so tempted to uh, want to speak to you on this, but I don't know. You know, at some point, maybe somebody across, you know, Africans, other Africans would benefit from this video. Not just for Sierra Leoneans, but of course, I want to share this with you. You know, this is Incheon Airport. This is in South Korea. You know, um, uh, I just want you guys to see what it is. You know, the kinds of planes, the humongous kinds of jets that are parked in this place. I mean, this place is so, so big, it's so huge. You know, world class airport. You know, something like this is what I wish for for our country in Sierra Leone. You know, the reason is this, guys. Uh, listen, countries like South Korea, you know, back in the day, 50s. Of course, they had a terrible war between North and South Korea, you know, 1950 to 1953, you know, but um, they've moved past that, you know, and um, look at what the country looks like today. I mean, Singapore has one of the best airports, but South Korea has an awesome airport as well. And you guys are seeing this firsthand, you know, whilst uh, we are uh, in Sierra Leone recently, I see we are celebrating the extension of a terminal. Oh, we, we have a new terminal, some people call it a new airport and stuff like that, you know. Um, heard about the Mamamaya airport plan that the former government of the APC had, but there is so much opportunities, guys. That's why I want you guys to see these for yourselves, because, you know, unfortunately, some of you guys would never have an opportunity to see places like this, and so when some of us come here and share stuff like this, people bluff for the gamble of it because, okay, no, 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 it is just that we have to share information, you know, information is wealth, you know, information and gentle. We, you know, for see I'm somebody can show you. That's why they show that this. I just they do a, you know, just this outside team up no more. Let's say look around. This airport is like this airport is 200 times bigger than Sierra Leone's airport. I can tell you that for a fact, for free, you know. And um, I, we, we deserve so much better. What's in South Korea, they all get, you know. I mean, they don't have, they don't get nothing on a mineral resource. We didn't get like good leaders them with good intentions for the country. That is why I share stuff like this so when I sell people. I don't want to see that. Yeah, what is this one great plane? A big plane, not a small plane, although this is not one of the small planes they wouldn't get to the land there. Yeah? Because they even get like the airbus there, but they like, don't put deck and plane. You know, you get upstairs, you get downstairs. All of them want to do it. Because like the one we bring me come from America, can South Korea. It's the same. You know, and then big plane that day. So look at the airports, guys. I just this is just a snippet of what the airport looks like. Why just do a round? Look at this wall full of But anyways, panels, uh, of course, as I see now. Me and some of my colleagues, then, you know, where we land in our airport now, and you know, uh, we uh, they go out for good, do we entry check with immigration and all that fun stuff. But look at how amazing this airport looks like. This is just the inside part of the airport, you know. These are the things we're saying Africa deserves better, Africans can do it as well. You know, I, I, I know countries like the Rwanda, they, they you know, they're doing well with their airports. Ghana's, Ghana's been doing the same thing too, good airports, you know. But for me, as far as Where I'm concerned, go? it's about Sierra Leone, that's what I'm thinking about. 
you know, when would we have? We can, we, we should, we should be able to afford a report like this, you know, uh, and, and, and that's the thing, which saddens me that we cannot do it. With all the gold diamond bauxite, which I, I don't know, all of this stuff, but greed and selfishness is what is killing us. But I just wanted to share this stuff with you guys, so you guys can see, you know. No, I didn't. Um, it's it's amazing. Yeah. Oh. That front. <laughs> man, look at this vast expanse, isn't it, man? You know, it's quite the experience out here. passing the work on to you guys. You see, I'm not going to cook for you. You cook for yourself. So pretty. Roomy Lodge. Yeah. It's beautiful. Whew, the weather is, uh, you know, a little rough. Guys, you know, uh, this is South Korea. You know, when I come to these countries like the South Koreas or, you know, uh, you know, any part of the world, I live in the United States. So, you know, development is not like a problem for me. But I think about Africa. I think about Sierra Leone, every opportunity that I get, right? When you come outside of, uh, you know, Sierra Leone, and you happening, the level of lack of development, right? It's just mind-blowing. And it's ridiculous. All of these countries have, uh, they've left us behind, man. <laughs> bridge for example there's this uh, a river way they, I think it called Yang, Yangtze river or something like that but um big big river this Wangi river has over 34 bridges then we for connect the country across you know so look at the look at the infrastructure look at the real estate a lot of this not the housing because South Korea uh, country is very hilly so they don't get land for begin build separate you know uh, single family homes then so what the government do they build towers then you know Towers upon towers, that's what they build, you know, for um, uh, the citizens there. And every citizen can afford it, you know. Again, a population of 51 million people. I mean, we, Sierra Leone, about 7.8 million, bro, 8 million people. With all the mineral resources that we have in Sierra Leone, we cannot afford these kinds of structures for our people. We still have slums. We still have people suffering, you know. When it rains, flooding, it's killing our people. Look at these apartments. Huh? South Korea did it. If they did, we can do it as well. Sierra Leoneans, we just have to demand more. We just have to ask. 
I mean, I'm miles away, but thank God I have a good phone so I can zoom in. But look at these apartment complexes. These are all apartments. These are homes. Citizens can afford to pay for these. They can buy it. There is job employment opportunities. This is what we're talking about, guys. So Sierra Leone, let's wake up, wake up, you know. It's sad when um, you see on social media some of these boys, you know, these uh, young women. We don't know where they suffer past anything. Who we talking? They can't challenge we. People can we talk and they can't challenge we. If you say we're all not company. I mean, in the sight of God and, the, you know, this universe, there's no, nobody no better passing company, but there are levels to this life. Look at, look at this. Some of you guys would never ever get an opportunity, but come see this still we talk. This is why Malik would talk with the vex. Because we see, we travel, we see the world, we know what we deserve. I'd live in America. We know what it's like. I live in the, you know, I don't see European countries them. I see them. So we're not to compare Sierra Leone to Europe or America, but let's compare ourselves to the South Koreas, to the Singapore's. Look at these countries, then they go, they are going ahead of us. Look at this, oh, these are all apartments, these are housing. These are not government offices, so this is not a government office. It's not hosting housing for the citizens of South Korea. These are their homes. That's when they build for them, tower after tower. Because the society is civilized. Tif Tif not the crookedness not the. The governments work for the people. That's why I'm sharing this with you guys, Sierra Leone and them. But to talk because my physical guy can't talk on social media and I for just talk because we feel for talk. Look at these tunnels upon tunnels them that in country. So suddenly they reach, you know, road, you know, the hill and they pass, and build tunnel. Look at these bridges, humongous bridges. Look at those homes. All that in a house, na housing for the people. All that in a CISO, they were in a housing for the people of South Korea. Look at community after community. I drive, they go. That's so all you see. Now, this you see them on a skyscraper after skyscraper. Skyscraper after skyscraper. Hey, brother, tell me about say salon, but we don't deserve this, bro. 7 million people, they were in a 51 million. We 7 million, we get gold, diamond, bauxite, fruit, I don't know. We all that back, we get IMF funding, then they come. Million, 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 million. Nothing. Look at all of these. I, I'm so mesmerized. You know, some people, then they see me, they me, they pain me, they see me, people in the suffer in that country. Today. Then they see, I see a video, and they throw a teacher, and things they do. Nah, 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 we'll be first by also. Or, 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 or Juba, I don't, I don't remember, I was part again, but I see a video, and they throw a teacher, and things they all do. Guys, look at all of those na housing, all down the United States, so na housing for the people of South Korea. In this day, you go inside the village, then I saw you this year. Look them Boston, where they get for transport people, they open down. All. Look at this na business district, this now. This na business, business place. You see the difference? When I see the difference with the apartment there and the business there? All of this, where they drive, what you see, na just beauty, man. Una look. Look the country where you find ball, look their road network. Look the apartment then. But I just said I share this with you now. I got for the share small, smaller where they go with different, different you know, activities where I've been involved in where without me divulging anything when I classified. But I'm just showing that the country as a whole, South Korea alone. I see I'm Sierra Leone and still we wake up, love, love, we country, love, we serve and hold we leaders accountable.